Good morning, Grade 2 class. Welcome to another recorded video for this week in our English 2. Let's continue. For our language lesson today, pronouncing words with the sound of R, OR, and ER. Okay, dapat yung baliktad na I. Pero since hindi available, I, I think you should understand that ER, yun yung sound niya. Found in your rainbows, page 253. Practice reading lang tayo, children. Okay, so let's read the following. Uh, repeat after me, okay? A dwarf in the garden. You repeat it, okay? A farm in the heart of the sea. This is very good. A park in the dark. Okay, very good. How about this one? This one is longer. The queen of hearts, she made some tarts. Go. Continue. All on a summer day, the knave of hearts. Okay, very good. He stole the tarts and took them clean away. Okay, very good. It's good uh, practice reading, children. So that's it for our language lesson for today. In our grammar lesson, we talked about the ing form of the verbs. And we said that rule number one, we use is plus the ing form uh, for singular subject. Pag isa lang ang pinag-uusapan, is plus ing form. Okay, dadagdagan na ng ing yung verb. Rule number, uh, for example, John is playing basketball. John is singular, so is playing. From the word play, naging playing. Rule number two, for plural subjects or two or more. R plus ING form. Okay? Meg and Len are baking a cake. Baking, galing sa salitang bake. Okay? So, pag plural, R plus ING form. Then lastly, uh, for pronoun I, am plus ING form. Example, I am studying my lessons. Yan. So, medyo madali-dali lang to. You just have to think kung ilan ang pinag-uusapan. Okay? For your activity today, uh, I want you to answer page 148 of your boot. Okay? GE. Then, submit it to me via Google Classroom. Okay? That would be all. Goodbye, grade 2.